my, my knee jerk response to you is that my hope is that the folks that have gone will reappear because not only is there a move, the move has been with established galleries moving from Wynwood, the design district, because the 36th street divides that, into Little Haiti, Little River, and now even further north. But most of the galleries that form the community of galleries, galleries such as ours, after when Bernie Steinbaum came and anchored that corner with her, her gallery, the, the theater, the tributaries of galleries, those have all disappeared. So Dana Lowenstein, who is a big gallery owner, similar to Virginia Miller in Carl Gables, has now moved into Little Haiti, unheard of. So with a move like that, smaller galleries, not only is there an increase in real estate, consequently, i.e. rent, the smaller galleries have no place to go. And, and the further north you move, if you think about the fact that, that Art Basel is the, is the big magnet, folks don't want to move out of that circle because folks are not going to come to you. So if you think about the, the, the economics of, 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 of the gallery business, you can move further north for affordable rent, but you will be out of the circuit. It is the circuit, the concentration of galleries in the Wynwood and the, Dan, the design district era that made this phenomena of Wynwood happen. It would not have happened without the, the small and I'm gonna say mom and pop galleries that were there. And we have all gone. Many of us, and I consider myself one of them, have continued to do the work. I had to pivot and morph and change and re, you know, this reset isn't gonna scare me, I've been doing it, you know? So um, we became a nomadic space where I would do a pop up and show an exhibition and pop down. And I started looking outside of Miami to offer the artists the experiences that we're offering them today. But Miami loses when these small incubator spaces are not able to allow young emerging artists to experiment. You know, the only space now, Locust Projects is the only space that is here where a young artist can do experimental work because the other galleries are transactional spaces where you put your work up and an expectation of a sale happens. Most of the artists I work with are not doing that kind of work. You know, so it, it, it's tough. 